Watch more programs like this on cable and stream with PCN Select. Subscribe at PCNTV.com. I'm here with Angela Ferrito, president of the Pennsylvania AFL-CIO. Angela, what are you expecting to hear in Governor-elect Josh Shapiro's inaugural address today? I, I think we'll hear how uh, Josh and Austin plan to lead the state of Pennsylvania um, with integrity and, and really um, helping the working class people and staying true to their campaign promises. What do you think a Shapiro administration will mean for unions in Pennsylvania? I think that uh, Shapiro administration will be good for unions in Pennsylvania. Um, I believe that he'll protect our rights and continue to fight for the laws that um, help unions to thrive and, and organize. Are there specific priorities you would like to see their administration address first that you think would most benefit those in the AFL-CIO? Well, um, of course, just protecting the rights of working people to have the right to collectively bargain and protecting the rights of public sector employees to continue to be able to collectively bargain, I think should be at the top of the priority list. Pennsylvania's minimum wage has still been at the federal minimum wage for over a decade now. Do you think that is something that the Shapiro administration should try to tackle in the uh, beginning of their, uh, their upcoming administration? Absolutely. Absolutely. I think that it's important for all working people to have that minimum wage raised, and I think it should be something that is right at the forefront of his, his administration. And last question for you. So what have you made of his selections thus far for uh, his cabinet? Is there any, uh, any particular positions that have stuck out uh, nomination-wise? Well, uh, he recently appointed Nancy Walker as the Secretary of Labor and Industry, and we are so excited to have Nancy in that position. Um, we have worked with Nancy when she was part of Josh's team in the Attorney General's office, and so we're just really excited to see what we're able to do for working people. Angela Frito, thank you for joining us. Thank you.